Reports indicate that Instagram will now allow users to post pictures and videos to their feed directly from the desktop website. According to screenshots posted by Matt Navara on Twitter, users can both edit and publish their posts through the desktop website, similar to how it's done on the mobile app. It's worth noting that not all accounts have received this feature, and reports say Instagram is still testing the feature with a limited set of users. According to reports, the launch of Samsung's alleged upcoming Galaxy S21 FE smartphone has been delayed due to the ongoing global shortage of chipsets. Reports reveal that the launch date has been postponed from early August to October and that the device will be released with limited availability. The alleged Galaxy S21 FE is supposed to be an affordable version of the flagship S21 series launched in January this year. Garmin has launched its Forerunner 55 fitness smartwatch in India. The Forerunner 55 sports a 1.04-inch circular display with a 208 by 208 pixel resolution and comes with Bluetooth connectivity along with compatibility for both iOS and Android. The Forerunner 55 is 5 ATM water resistant and Garmin claims the smartwatch can last up to two weeks in smartwatch mode and delivers up to 20 hours of continuous usage in GPS mode. Additionally, it features heart rate monitoring, stress and sleep monitoring and can also track respiration, hydration, steps and a wide variety of fitness activities. The Garmin 4 Runner 55 has been priced at 20,990 rupees in India. The US House of Representatives Judiciary Committee has reportedly voted in favor of a bill that would require big tech firms to choose between running a platform and competing on it. The vote completed two days of voting on four bills that are aimed at reining in the power of tech companies in the US. It's worth noting that there has been opposition from both lawmakers and the US Chamber of Commerce against the measures. Computer maker Dell has confirmed that four severe vulnerabilities with its laptop, desktop and tablet devices could let hackers take over the devices. Dell has reportedly released a patch for the BIOS Connect feature that contained the weakness, affecting over 30 million computers. Reports indicate that the feature is designed to allow for remote recovery and firmware updates, but also provided backdoor access to hackers.